Alright, it's time. Last week we got Dean Wade. And lads, all I'm going to say, while this guy may not be Dean Wade, he is almost, if not equally as iconic. And all we got to say is, all hail Lord Dino. Dino Raja is back in the game. Not only is he back, he's as OP, if not more OP than last year. And he's 20k. I bought mine for 18k. He is under 20k. He is under 20k. Let's just say that. Let's just count it down. And let's just wrap our heads around that. He's under 20k. Like, I got Wiseman. I got Dino. I got Bowl Bowl. And I got um, Bill Russell. Now, I don't need a new power forward or center the rest of the year. I got, basically, if you put Porzingis in there for Bill Russell, well, Bill Russell might be better than Porzingis. You've got four, just, just, there's demigods. He's just a demigod, six foot 11, but you'll see in game, he's gonna play like he's seven foot three because he's got max wingspan. He's got 49 Hall of Fame badges. Catch and shoot corner specialist. Brick wall, drop stepper, dimer rim protector, clamps, interceptor, intimidator, and um, worm, back down puncher, rise up, anti freeze, circus threes, hot shot, deep threes. He's got giant slayer as well. He has got rhythm shooter. I don't even know what that is on next on current gen. He's got flexible if you're on current gen. He's got 16 gold as well. So he's got every key badge except for ankle breaker, post riser, and if you're on next gen blinders. He's got every key badge except for those in the game. And not only that, if you look at his attributes, like stats, 92 driving lay, lay up, 92 post up, 92 post fadeaway. That's nice. He's got a 96 three ball, 95, or 85 driving dunk, 86 ball handle, 91 block. Not the great steal rating, but he's got a 7-11 wingspan with half interceptor. That doesn't, that steal rating does not matter. 95 offense, defense, rebound, 92 speed, 88 lateral quickness. So yeah, he, he's maybe a, an inch or two taller than some of those other demigods, but he's also got a higher speed stat, which is going to make him feel like equally as fast. So lads, let's just check out just the way this guy moves. He may not move quite as fast as a bull bull, but he's still got that glitchy behind the back. He's still got the glitchy side to side, curry slide. He's still got this glitchy move. You can still burst out of it really, really well. He still gets those same bursts. And again, you can just see by his player build, by his arm length, he is very much just like a poor man's bow ball. He's like better Pokashevsky. That's the best way to describe him, is better Pokashevsky. Release, it's fine. The base is, like again, base four is fine. The upper, I don't really know how I feel about it, but I'm not too high on it. I'm also not low on it at all. I think it is a very, very solid release. But like... Again, just the way Dino moves. The way even Dino moved on his Ruby card to start of the year. Like, he just moved so well. And his Amethyst card, which was insane for the time, was unbelievable. And this card right here is even better. Like, it's the way he's going to attack people. Again, you got to put Showtime on him if you're on current gen. You got to put Posterizer on him if you're on next gen. I'm probably not putting him on this account. I'll have Posterizer definitely gold on him on my um, main account. And again, Showtime is pretty much a key badge. But other than that, though, it's near perfect. Again, as you guys can see, behind the back is Elite. Um, it's just mo overall movement is absolutely, absolutely Elite, lads. Is absolutely Elite. So, all we gotta say is, all hail Lord Dino. Oh man, I, I'm so happy this card is a thing, and he's only 20k. And it's the day he comes out. He'll be like 15k max by this time next week. Like, when he's out of XP, he will be max. Like, honestly, he'll probably be 10k when he's out of XP. Man, Dino is insane. We're getting so many insane cards in my team right now. I would have thought they would have waited and given us a Dark Matter Dino. Maybe we do get a Dark Matter Dino, which honestly can't be that much different than this, unless they give him a better base than base 4. But, uh, yeah, absolutely. I do wish they gave him... I was about to say, I wish they gave him Trey Young base, which he had at the start of the year, which he actually didn't. He, he always had base 4. There's a bunch of guys that were literal clones of Dino. Um, and they all had the exact same SIGs, the exact same jump shot. And they actually changed Dino's dribble SIGs, if I'm not mistaken. They changed something about Dino anyway. 
that he was no longer one of clothes. They're Mo Williams clones now. But anyway, now it's Grimm on three. And that's a bad release. Now let's get on to the game. Okay, so let's have a look at what he is like right now. Let's let's go and play a bit of triple trad offline or online. And let's sub in Lord Dino. Let's sub in Lord Dino and see how he gets on. Because this guy right here is a demon. It's gonna he's gonna be a tough one to stop. He is going to be a tough, tough player to stop, lads. Alright, so. Let's see what he has. Okay, RJ Hampton, Alexei Pokashevsky, and Cliff. I mean, Cliff is pretty good. I want to see if we can shoot with Cliff, though. Not everyone can shoot with that release. It is, a, it is a weird upper. I do really like it, but very few people can shoot with it. All right, let's go. Oh, Dino and Eddie Curry. I'm going back to my 2K20 combo. Does he have analysts for days? Yeah. Are you really just going to spam? Get onto a side. Like, literally, play a side. Don't just spam. What takeover do I have? Find out in a second. Oh, he's just going to spam, isn't he? That's this guy. I reckon that's going to be this guy's entire tactic is just spamming that square button. Curry. Hi. Nope. We're heavy. That's a heavy. I don't know why I felt like I was open there. Okay. He gets sharp take, which is very interesting. Three shots and it is takeover time. Just get in front of Pukashevsky so we can't get... We can test. It's a really good contest there by Cliff. And just like that, we're down by four. It's fine. It's fine. We're good. Just inbound the ball. Bobby Jones, you can do that, can't you? Okay, we're good. Oh, it's kind of... No. Oh, don't be dumb, Mick. Don't be dumb. Okay, we're good. Jump. Run. Run, Mick. Or run, Dino. Run, Dino. Run, Dino. It's open. Please, please, green. First open shot I got with Dino, it's a green. We probably need two more, probably maybe even three more makes before we can trigger take. This is not ideal. What's he doing? What is he doing? This is probably the guy that reminds me most of Dino's Pokashevsky and just the way he moves and the way he feels. What am I doing? And how did he miss that layup? How did he get that rebound? What is going on in this game? What even is 2K21? I've about eight things that I don't understand how it happened happened on that one play and he made and that's the shot he makes and he missed the open layup. <sighs> all right okay we're good he's literally just spamming I don't know how to beat this actually I do know how to beat it. attacking the basket attacking the basket is what's going to um beat this guy because he is just overly overly extending on that three-point line and green Green to 29. That's impressive. He is not the easiest there. Uh, he is not the easiest player to green with. Maybe he does know his release. Okay, we're way out of position here. He let me get back into position. I'll take that. You can green with him. You Fair play. If you can green base 30, then just, you're just too good. What? what type of animation was that? Way off. Big board, Dino. What type of animations am I being triggered? Does he not have unpluckable or something? Okay, Bobby Jones has got secondhand embarrassment from how many times Dino has turned the ball over. Which is an unfortunate an unfortunate badge in this game. A Dino himself who turns the ball over, he's fine. But Bobby Jones, who's on just on the team. He's getting second-hand embarrassment as we green another shot there with Dino. And I don't know how close we are to take. Probably one green off take, though, to be honest. Okay, we're actually not too far behind. It's fine. That's, that's needless. I was trying to get a bump there and a switch, but... That is not what we wanted. 
Okay, we're good. Just stick on him. That is not very great right there. All right. Let's go. Right to the basket. Easy dunk there by Dino. And I don't think dunking is going to help me get take. I think hot shots what's get me take. Ah, oh, it's a steal. Come on. We're good. Ah, uh, we've given up an open dunk. Bye by me. Okay, a three-pointer here and we'll win this game. I'm telling you, a three-pointer here and we'll win this game because we have, we'll have control because we've got take. And he's he just took a take. Okay, that's good. It's fine. I'm good with that. Because we're going to green right here with Dino and we're going to trigger take right back at him. We're going to turn this into a bottle of... A bottle of Dino versus Cliff and he turns it over. He's going to jump. Oh. Screw it. I'm going to shoot a setback. I'm going to shoot that because why not? Why the hell not? Anyone was going to come up with a crazy big shot, it was Dino, and he's going to kick to a shooter. That's dumb. So dumb. Great block by Dino. The joys. The joys of the 7 foot 11 wingspan on Dino Raja right there. Working wonders. He's going to go to a shooter. No. Good move. Good move. See how, how tightly he picks me up. And not tightly enough at all. Get in. Get in. Get in. I've missed three of those shots in a row. That's probably the first time I've ever missed three of them in a row. That shot goes in at such a high rate. And he blew it. He blew it. Do you know, just get into a position where you can shoot from. There we go. Nope. Pass out of that. Do you know, that's you. And his spam, his just defense, which consists of spamming the square button, is obviously not work, not doing great for me. Okay. Set the screen. There we go. In his face. That's my fault. Shoot that one. In his face. There. Green. Let's go. I can shoot close to 100%. I can shoot some others. Oh, it's a steal! There's no threes, no threes, no threes. A two and I win. That's all I'm going to say. A two and I win. Yeah. I'm just going to pull up. I'm just going to shoot this in his face. There we go. Green. Game. All hail Lord Dino. That is the only way. That is the only way we can describe that game right there. Dino just being Dino, I guess. Ooh, a mystery pack. That is a uh, not bad thing to get early enough in a, uh, in a my team board. So, uh, yeah, now let's get on to the end bit of this video where we just say that Dino for his value might be the best center in the game. Like, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with my lineup right now. Like, I got Wiseman, I got Dino, I got Bull Bull, I got Mirasan, who I really like to run around with. I got Bill Russell. I got a lot of guys on my team. Oh, man, I don't even know what to do with my team. And I don't even have anyone that's over 100k in my team. <laughs> I still don't know what to do with it. Anyway, yeah. That's pretty much it. This card's insane. That's the video. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.